just left this for you. Don't want to review this. If you don't review it, I'm going to have your testicles. Love, miseriness. Well, I have to say, it's bally nice would give me a choice. Oh, my lord, this is the most whimsical play of the season. Except it's not a play. Or any good. But it is whimsical. Minion! Do the dance of whimsy! So even though the beast became a twat at the end of part one, he's a man again. Animal again. Man animal again. A man animal again. But he looks shit because the animation is shit. And his voice is well. Well. Shit. So there's all these little beasties running around and they're being lamps. Should have been stepped on the little bloody aliens! One of them's a deaf chandelier, and the candle gets very annoyed yelling at it. I can sympathise. Do you want any tea? Fine. Be like that. There's also a talking dictionary. I couldn't possibly do that to her. Who would clean up the mess? And then there's a thing where a brush fucks a candle in a talking punch bowl. And I will represent it by doing this. Board waiting for Gaston to turn up. He has muscles the size of cock! No, no, sorry. He has a cock the size of my muscles. It's like that. Then there's a the kettle who was Angelina Lansbury in the first one, but she's not anymore, so she's shit. So then the teapot, who's not Angelina Lansbury and therefore is shit, has a tea party. And the teapot pours the tea from her own head! Why can't I pour tea from my head? No. I'll try it later. So there's absolutely no story. Well, actually, there's a lot of stories and one of them has a bird in it. It's like no story, but then they cut it into a lot of little bits of nothing. And there's still the little beasties running around and being tables and things. I was a table once. Well, probably I just had absinthe. And then I spent a few days chasing a dragon. I never caught him. So they ended with Beauty and the Beast being in love. And Beast shows is in love by yelling and growling. It's like this. Hello, Basley, Basley. Roar! Roar! You want to put it where? Roar! With a cucumber? Well, I'd much rather prefer a potato. Roar! How did you know I was wearing crotchless bloomers? Roar! I love you too. And then it's over and no one explains why the Beast has the in his name and Beauty doesn't. Well... I really don't have an ending, so... What a bit.